What is good friends? We are here with uh, Super Marshall vs. G Meek for SBL Week 7 Sun and Moon OU. And um I think the Cryos are 6 and 0 in the series versus the Raiders. Ah uh, not versus the Raiders. <laughs> my bad, my bad. The Cryos are playing versus the Runners. Are you on smoke doors? Yeah yeah. Okay, I'm okay, watching I it. I got BTB in the car. So he has a bishop. Bishop is a threat. Yeah, bishop is like uh, a threat. Is it? Is it uh, Z move? Uh, or Z move Gera. I don't. Th I think it's Scar for Amosa. Yeah, yeah. I, it's uh, it's probably um, Alakazam, Mega Alakazam, and um, Super Sonic Fly Strike. Or Gyarados and it's um, Stealth Rock Chomp would be interesting to see if it's Life or Mixed Chomp or it could be Sash, it could be the Tank Chomp, but that on that's not a set that only Padlop uses Tank Chomp. Ooh, turn one Dazzling Gleam. That could it be me. Scarf Rocks? Yeah, if you're a Docker you can run Scarf Rocks. Oh, NGMP runs that. That's a that's a cool set. Saw some usage in last OST, uh, last OLT. Um, pretty sure he's not Scarf if he switches. Oh, he predicts the Lando, but nah, nah. If he predicts the Lando, he wouldn't have gone to Magirna. Yeah. Unless yeah, if he, if he, pre even if he predicted the Lando, he would have gone for the rocks. Maybe he's Ice Beam Magirna. So I'm pretty sure he's gonna U-turn here because the Ice Beam is so obvious, and the, the Scissor is the perfect switch in. Yeah. I mean, High Jump Kick would do a lot to Scissor. It's not Mega yet. It would be a wild prediction. Mm. Yeah, but I, I don't see him like. The going only reason the Lando stays here. in is if it's Yachi Berry. Uh, even if it's Yachi Berry, uh, what does the Lando even like uh, do it back to the Ramosa? Uh, the like the set usually. Yeah. I run is it EQ, U turn, Ice, uh, Hidden Power, Ice. Yeah. So. If he only has if he has Stone Edge, it doesn't kill. Yeah. And if he's in Power, it also doesn't kill. Yeah. So he needs the guy, the the lander's healthy for the chomp kind of, and it also takes a hit from Magirna. It gets helmet damage on the Gyarados. Uh, he goes on a slow. Uh, so it was a nice mid ground, I guess. Because it's just um, yeah. If he, in case he went for the head JK, head JK. Uh, and I don't think he didn't go out into the Coco in case he went for the poison jab. You think it's um, pursued Bishop? It it could be. I mean, his team is not really weak to like. Uh, Laddies. Uh, I mean, Laddies. Yeah, and it, and it isn't even like weak to Lele. So yeah, I, uh, he's not the. So the scissor. He's people. life orb. So yeah, it's he's it's probably knockoff. I didn't hear Sucker Punch and Sword Stance. The scissor is either like um, roosting here or you turning potentially. I think he has to roost. Yeah, I the think he's, yeah, he has to roost because like um, scissor like checks a lot. So, but uh, a problem could be like if he goes SDs. if he goes for the roost and yeah if he has these, that could be kind of problematic. Yeah, gotcha, but doesn't catch him die to bullet punch. If it's max attack. Yeah, Garchomp Garchom just dies to bullet punch from this range. Wait, how did the Gajum even get that low? A uh, dazzling gleam from the oh, Coco. Yeah, right, right, right. Um. Yeah, yeah Coco is like Coco. Coco is like looking like a huge threat. Like he has like no checks to Coco at all. Like uh, obviously Feromosa is with if it has poison jab. But, but uh, other than that, uh, like Coco just clean sweeps. I mean, Magina is a decent oh, check. Oh, it is a tank chomp. Fire blast. Oh, why didn't he not? No. Hmm. He, he I think killing the, the scissor that would have been nice because scissor walls like maybe his HP five. Uh, this, this is this is like I think it is like no attack investment. Mega scissor, it's yeah, like I just so. investing defense HP. Yeah, like scissor runs a lot of defense to check Metagross. Uh, even though he has a slow bro too for Meta, but there's Thunder Punch. There's a lot of slow bro. I don't really know why he has a slow burn on that team, that's like a momentum killer kind of. Yeah, yeah, I agree. 
I don't like Slovo on the team. I mean, it's either HP Fire Magina or HP Fire Scizor, because otherwise he's too weak to Scizor. I mean, Sky Strike kills from this range too, obviously. I mean, he's not like too weak to Scizor because he has a tank chomp. Yeah, but if he like didn't get it, we get let it get weakened then. If he played better yeah. and didn't let the scissor get this low, the scissor Yeah, like, uh, like, even if he, like, uh, T-bolted, I guess Major Majerno is, like, a safer play than, like, risking the guard chomp because his only scissor check was the guard chomp. Maybe he's not a swap as Megina if he didn't want to switch it in on the Coco. He could be Trick Room again. Yeah, 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 that, yeah, that could be possible. He could too. be, um, I don't think he's e moved though with the Gera. Like with the Magiana. That doesn't make too much sense to me. Like... I think Faramosa doesn't even kill this from here if it's super defensive. But, so. but uh, do you think uh, it could be Trick Room because like all his other moments are like fast? I mean, sometimes that's like late game cleaner. Yeah, he's uh, he's uh, Gmik is definitely going for the SD here. I mean, tank chop is also not that fast, and bishop is also not that fast, so trick room makes some sense versus offense. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Even though tank chop is super weak, so the trick room doesn't really help it. But yeah, he's just gonna knock off. He he yeah, he's gonna knock off here, and uh, pro this uh, Marshall is probably going to go for the U turn. Um. Yeah, these, these are like pretty standard plays. I ran superpower sometimes in Auras when I was so weak to Bishop. Yeah, but I mean, like, no, like, that, I don't, I, I've never seen superpower Bishop in Sun. Yeah, I didn't see it. I just wanted to mention that. I mean, there's no way, there's no way you go Coco here predicting a sucker punch. But... Yeah, he's not going to even sucker punch, he's going to go for the straight up uh, knockoff. Uh, or suck. He could sucker punch, I mean, but uh, that's gonna... more, this is, uh... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That, that's right. Saka got nerfed. Yeah. Uh, to how much? From eighty to seventy, I think. Oh, that sucks. But it's still a bit stronger than knockoff. Knockoff is like sixty-five. Yeah, but it's like just. Yeah, I, I would always go for the knockoff here because, like, it's not like worth risking though. Yeah, if like play. Marshall decides to be crazy and like uh, doubles to the Coco, it's not like worth risking the a turn waste, right? Yeah. Oh, he goes for the SD again on know. the U turn. I mean, now he kills the uh, Coco from fall. Yeah, this he doesn't have enough life up hits, so I don't know if I like I don't know if I like that play. Also, uh, if yeah. He, Okay, so he didn't go out into the Zygarde, which means... No E-Speed? No E-Speed. I mean... This could be Rose Coco to try and outplay a Sucker Punch, but probably... Probably Vortex. Do you think this is a Jolly Bisharp? Uh, I think it's Jolly. Let me see how much it did. It did 39 to Scizor. Okay, that, that, that did a lot of damage. It could be adamant, uh, but like if it is adamant, then uh, why not like go out in a Zygarde and like bluff? Uh, yeah, I, I I don't understand that play because like at least you could have gone out in the Zygarde, bluffed something. Um, Thirty nine seems like a lot. Let me count that. Yeah, that's definitely not jolly. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, so what? Uh, so what? So this is what, this uh, is what Marshall actually... could have done was like uh, he could have gone out in the Zygarde instead of going out in the Coco. He could have like subbed, subbed, and played those 50-50 mind games. Scissor is actually uh, super offensive. It's not. It's either Spadef or offensive because. Yeah, like yeah. Th there goes the Scissor too. Because the cock says um. Life of Bishop versus uh, knockoff versus si 16 defense scissor. That's 28 to 34. But it did 39. Uh -huh. 
Yeah. yeah. So the bitch, the, the scissors yeah, like, like, spit try, death? Try. Was it either spit death or it makes attack? I don't know. Oh, uh, was, was the damage before the Mega Evolution or after the Mega Evolution? Oh, I haven't checked that. Oh, well, yeah, it probably was for the Mega Evolution. Yeah, it was before the Mega okay, Evolution. Okay, so, so it is bulky as scissor then, my bad. This is weird. Why does he go to this this la like this late? Yeah. So like yeah, if Zygarde outspeeds this, then he just has to sub twice to like kill the life outfits, that's all. Isn't Marshall like a DPP player? I don't think he played Sun and Moon ever. Not sure. Oh, he has E speed. Hmm. Yo, oh, why did he do all this then? Lana said it's choice band. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I didn't see killed. the point of. I didn't. I didn't see the point of like sacking both Coco and Cesar. It would have killed. Like it. if, he, like especially if he had E speed, because if it's bad, uh, it would have killed. I think. I think Cesar, uh, Cesar and Coco are like more important than Zygar, and E speed is plus two priority. Unlike uh, in Gen 4, you said he was Gen 4 player, right? E speed has like plus one priority in Gen 4. Really? I mean, he probably knows those mechanics. Uh, the, yeah, the, it's still wondering like why he didn't go on his eye guard and stuff. Sacking with the Coco and well, Scissor. Ended, yeah. I don't know why he just sacked right. his Faramosa like that when he. Yeah, yeah, both players is like sacking their mons. <laughs> um, look at Reska, I, everyone is like, everyone, look at the child. Like, I assume, I they, assume. Uh, they seriously don't know what's happening here. I assume he thought it was not Bandit Zygarde. Because if it was Bandit Zygarde, he would have brought it out earlier. It's what, it's what his opponent was thinking. So he saw yeah, it yeah, was yeah. not And he didn't want to go to Magina and potentially take a thousand arrows. <laughs> I mean, he doesn't have Magiena switch ins. But, uh, Fermosa against the opponent's team was like huge. Like, he could have ice beam this, he could have ice beam this. U turn. Anything kills a Fermosa. I'm trying to figure out the, the, the scissor spread. Yeah, the scissors like um. Yeah, it's super defensive. It's not the standard spread that one sixteen defense. <coughs> I assume it has like one hundred eighty defense investment, something along those lines. Oh, yeah, yeah. for Flock and why did Slowbro eat that? Is it like mixed defensive Slowbro or Solver Slowbro? It's probably Azorotus because I don't see an item. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, it cannot be Mega unless he's using two Megas. <laughs> so the land revealed rocks. It can it can take one psychic. So if it's not HP, I um... It could it could be an all out plumbing uh, Feramosa, the Quiver Dance, all out plumbing one. Like, I'm wondering if he like tries to pivot from Slowbro into um, Zygarde here, but that depends. I don't know if E Speed kills the Zam. From no, no, E Speed definitely. E Speed uh, does not kill a Mega Zam because like Mega Zam has 65, 65 defense, yeah, from and a regular Relic Zam has like 45 defense. Yeah. Base, I mean. Like so, he cannot pivot around on. So it's just uh, but but Landorus like leaves one right? Yeah, he do it Landorus does. Dies to rocks now. Oh, it's life orb that didn't kill. Wow, how did that live? I mean, it was minus one, but still. If it was max attack life orb that makes that's weird that it lived. Yeah. 
I'm wondering if he had Sludge Wave and HP Ice on this Landorus to lure and tap Bubulu and opposing Landorus. Yeah, probably. Um, does, does Life Orb uh, uh, HP Ice like okay on opposite Landorus? I think it does a lot. Like after Rocks it probably Okos. Yeah, like uh, no, like no investment, or uh, does like around fifty-ish. Like if he has some special attack. He, so that was, uh, I think that, yeah, that's HP Electric. So you probably didn't want the Gera to set up. And he's probably yeah. did, um, specs Fermosa, and that's AV Magina. Yeah. Specs Fermosa and AV Magina. Like, I don't know, whatever. Could also be Scarf, um, and it's not AV. <laughs> um, what, what's, what, what health is the Slowbro going to be at? It was 14% the last time it left, so... It gets uh, after 33, 33 per, and it loses 12, so it's at like 30-something. Yeah. It's gonna be plus at... Plus 33. Yeah, plus 33 minus 12, like 35. It's gonna be around 35. Yeah, it, it, uh, last time I think it, the Slower Cannon did around like 49. So, this time the slow rope can tank. So, yeah, floor cannon here gets a kill. Yeah, pro he, he's probably gonna sack the slow bro here. And floor cannon can miss. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's there too. I mean... Zam, I like Zam dies to rock, so... Zygarde should win this game, yeah, like someone said in the chat. I mean... Yeah, Zygarde probably I is. think Gyarados doesn't outspeed Faramosa at plus one, so you sack Slowbro here? You click... Oh, uh, <laughs> Dark, you jinxed it. I mean... He's faster, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah, it, it doesn't matter, like, unless he decides to, like... He can pivot out, but Slowbro doesn't do much. Sack, though. I don't think it's worth it. Yeah, yeah. You sex Like he couldn't miss again. Then he goes to Zygarde and then he probably sex the Zam. And then the question yeah. if 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 Zygarde can live a supersonic sky strike. If Zygarde can live a supersonic sky strike, he wins. Cause um for like no, I think he wins anyways, because yeah, Scar right Faramosa outspeeds not Scarf. I think. Yeah, most... yeah, his play, his play is to go for the supersonic sky strike here. Yeah, he and Zygarde, like Zygarde, probably still lives. I mean, uh, for most outspeed. Yeah, I think G I, I think G Mix should win this game. No, no, Marshall wins with Fermosa. Oh, he, I forgot he has a thing in the he has a Magina in the back. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> My bad. I mean, <laughs> so supersonic sky strike is going to do like around. Uh, 70 ish. I mean, 1000 arrows kills the Gera. So Marshall still oh, yeah. wins if he lifts this guy's turn. I don't think 1000 arrows is. 1000 arrows kills the. I mean, it's it's banned that it kills. Wait. It, does, it does like 45% to Tabu Fini. Um, it, will uh, easily, it will easily do 76 to a Gera does. It's adamant uh, choice band, right? Yeah. So uh, that's like around 492 attack. That's like. I mean, I don't think Gavados runs any bulk. Uh, Mega Mary Chance resisted high kick, high jump kick on the Gyarados. Approximately. Uh, let me let me let me ca calc this real quick. One of the manager is coming out. <laughs> I'm happy at least Mega Mobile is coming out soon. I'm pretty sure this doesn't live. <coughs> BDC says it lives one. Wait, why did he switch? What? He sacks the. Very awesome. Actually, that was a good play. Yeah, uh, that's still a fine thing. No, never mind. He just gets the boost. So oh, he 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 gave, he gave it an attack boost. 
Yeah, so, that, one second, that, that oh, one second, one second, let's let's count this. That didn't make a difference then. Zygarde. Oh, he tries banned. Yeah, oh. he crit, he crit. Yeah, it is. Can you, yeah. Someone says crit meta, but I don't know the count. So yeah, Marshall just wins now and... I think this week is over. You make it. Oh, you make it. I, I'm not sure if it mattered, probably. Maybe it was a roll. It does 74 to 87, so yeah. It was a roll in his favor. Yeah, I don't know why he... I don't know why he switched out this side. That was really weird. Thousand hours. Uh, what the fuck? If he dragon dance, didn't he win? Okay, so he's like he's like running no speed on Zygar. Like he's not running no HP in, in HP investment on Zygar. It's like max speed Zygar. It's adamant max speed Zygar. And yeah. adamant. No, it can't be adamant Gyarados. Like you have to run Jolly Gyarados like to outspeed most of the things. Oh, uh, so it is a Jolly Zygarde since it, uh, since it outspread the j Jolly Gyarados. So no, no, even adamant like max attack, max speed oh, yeah, outspeeds bad. Gyarados. So, um, I think Zygarde is like base ninety. Um, ninety five. Adamant, choice bound. So if it, if it was Jolly Zygarde, the crit hours. obviously mattered probably then. There should be the crit Eternal Spirit game Jolly coming up Spirit. soon. Yeah, uh, yeah, I think the crit mattered because if was Jolly, uh, Gyarados was. like lives one, but uh, no, the crit, the crit doesn't matter because like even Zygarde lives one hit from the Gyarados and it outspeeds the next turn. Yeah. So um, the crit doesn't. So yeah, it's the score is seven and zero for the Cryos. So Runa's already lost a week, which is crazy. Maybe I was the Samrock is just gonna be for fun. It doesn't matter. So I hope they will bring bring some creative sets. Yeah. Like the Cryos have, um, I think two people left the team. Um, what's it called? They had Kyle Colin doubles and he left. And they said he left out of nowhere. So NJP has to play doubles now and he won his game, which is nice to see. <coughs> Spoilers. I mean, I didn't record that game, so of course I can spoiler it. I mean, I guess for the people that wanted to watch the replay, it's a spoiler. But I will upload this next day anyway, so they will have already seen the replay. Yeah. yeah thank you guys for watching. Uh, thanks BTB for being in the video. Um, we'll see you next uh, in a few minutes with um, probably Eternal Spirit. Who's he playing again? He's playing with Obliviate or Obliviate, a German player. Okay, nice. Okay, so Obliviate. Stay tuned for that. Nice. Peace out, friends.